okay so now we need to create a node model and inside that node model we will store all of our data for example the id and the title the date the priority and also the status and by status i mean this button so if the status is zero then this node will be active and if the status is one then this node will be shown as completed so in the lib folder right here we will create another directory by the name of models and inside this models we will create a new dot file by the name of not underscore model and right here we will create a class name note and inside here we will create an integer and also add this null check okay this question mark is known as null checker in flutter now for example if you delete this it will show us an error As you can see, so we need to add this question mark with it. Okay, and after this, we will add a string and then a null checker, and this will be title. And the reason that is showing an error because we are an equal sign, so make sure to remove the equal sign. And then the next one will be the date time, and then it will be equals to date then the next string will be priority and then the last one will be a integer and its name will be status so if the status is incomplete then we will show zero and if the status is complete then we will show one okay the status will be equals to one so now after this right here we will add a note and in here we will say this dot title then this dot date and then after this we will add this dot priority and then this dot status and after this we will say note dot with ID okay make sure that the I is capital of the ID so no dot with with ID so right here we will say this dot ID and then we can simply copy all of this from there and paste it right down below and right here we will add semicolon and now when we store our node object inside our database okay then we have to convert our node to a map okay we need to convert our node to map so for that we are going to write the function to map it so right here we will say map then inside this map we will pass a string then a dynamic and right here we will say to map then we will say final map and this will be equals to map so string and dynamic after this we will say map then the first one is the title so the title will be equals to title then the next one is the date so the date will be equals to date add a null checker so date dot to iso at thousand six zero one string okay we want to convert the date to this format so after the date we have the priority so type it like this then we have the status and after this we will simply return map 
so now once we convert our node to map then if we are grabbing the node from the database we have to write a function to convert the map back to a node object so for converting the map back into a node object then for that we will create a function so right here we will type factory then node from map and then in the brackets we will say map then string and then the next one is dynamic and inside here we will say return return node dot with id we will return the node with the id so the first one is the id so we will say id then map and inside a single quotes we will type id and after the id we want to convert to title so right here we will say title map and then title then the next one is date so we want to convert the date from this format to the date time format so type date time dot phrase and the formatted string will be map then we will say date after this we will convert the priority and the status and also right here at the top right here we will say if the id is not equals to none so if the id is not equals to none then we will say net id and the id will be equals to this id variable so our not model is now completed and now see you guys in the next video